Aye, so the wall is down and tidied up, so we're going to start building that back up. Got a mix on. What I've done is because I don't think I'll need that much, I've done half a mix. So normally I work five to one, so if I did five buckets of sand to one bucket of cement and that would all go in, but that would be too much. So I've got these bags from the builders merchants. Now these bags are 35 kg and normally the other ones come in 25. So for ease, you just go five bags at 25, one bag of cement at 25, gives you a five to one mix. That's an easy way to do it and you're not using the bucket. So you just put it straight in the mixer. But these are 35, so that's 105 k to 25, which is roughly four to one instead. Because there's roughly four 25s in 105, so we're a bit over. Four to one's fine, it's just a stronger mix. So that's what I'm gonna do just to make my life a bit easier. So I've put in one bag of that, half a bag of that sand, half a bag of cement, that's all in there. I've put in some frost proofer. Weather's okay now, but if it gets cold in the next few days as it's going off, that'll give it some protection and it's gonna aerate it and make it easier to work with. So that's in and that's my other half mix. That's just one way to do it. If I had those 25 kg bags, it would be two full bags, half a bag of 25 and that. Or if you did two 25s and half a bag, that would be a straight four to one. Depends how strong you want your mix to be. Four to one or five to one is sufficient for most things. Cool.